Hello, kindergarten families. I would just like to go over the writing and the math packet with you so you know how to use these materials with your child as we continue our journey with online learning. So you have our writing packet in here. I'm hoping all of you got a name tracing practice. And a lot of us are doing so amazing at writing our name every day. So kudos to your child. Um, there is a nonfiction retelling hand. This is something I would like you to use with your child as you are reading books with them. And um, you want them to name the topic, the main idea of the book, three details, and some other vocabulary or details or text features. And so just, you know, text features are anything like the captions, the labels, the diagrams. We really want your child to look at those pictures and understand that that gives them information about the topic. We also have our writing checklist. We've been using this at the beginning or at the very end of our writing. Um, we've started with only the top two. I'm just going kind of really slow to introduce so your child understands what each one means and how we can be self-reflective as far as being improving our writing. We have some sound spelling cards. So boys and girls, um, I'm sorry, parents, this is a sound spelling um, card for your child to use as we begin to spell some more challenging words that might be above their level. I have introduced a few of them, but I will refer to it. So if you could have this handy when your child is writing, you can kind of introduce to them the different spelling patterns. And on the back, it's kind of like a mini word wall that we can start using as well. I know I asked you to create a word wall, and they can also use this as a resource as well, because here are some other words that don't play fair by the rules. Another resource is my sight words. It's a little more condensed and easier to use if your child prefers one or the other. And then um, we also have some topic sentence starters that we will start, start to use coming up very soon. Um, in the right, and we have our letter naming. We have all the different months of letter naming. Um, I would suggest um, you use this with your child as much as you can. Um, your child needs to know and identify all the letter names and sounds. You can go through and have them do this. You can time them and record them to see if they're progressing. Our goal is to have 52 letter names in one minute. So please continue to practice with that. Um, and then we have our writing journal. We have a couple different writing journals in here. So um, every day when we are writing, please have your child use this writing journal because once again, we have this space for the name and the date and then for the sentences. And then pretty soon, your child will also be using the back side as well because our goal at the end of the kindergarten school year will be to write at least four to five complete sentences. And so that is our writing materials. Um, Moving on to the math packet here. In your math, we have some other resources we will be using. Um, this is kind of a, a worksheet that I would like to do with the kids in class. Um, I will probably do this next week or the following week just to kind of go over some different skills as well. Fluency cards within five. One of our kindergarten standards is to um, be fluent in adding and subtracting to five. So if you wanna take some time or have your child cut these out, they can be little flashcards that you can practice. Um, we will start doing um, addition and subtraction time fluency tests. This is where your child will need to solve these equations. So those will be coming up very soon. Um, and then you also have um, resources for some of the upcoming games that your child will be introduced to. So hold on to those because I refer to them um, in my week at a glance or I take a picture of them when we need to get that game ready for the day. And please remember, when we are playing games, it is really important that you are there with your child to play um, these games with them because it's um, they need a partner. And so we want you to be there learning and interacting and engaging with your child. And then the last thing is just our tricky teens. I did put some extra practice sheets in here for you to use at any time. So go ahead and have your child trace the number, write the number, find the number. We know that tricky teens can be um, a challenge for our kindergarten friends. So go ahead. And if you, uh, anytime you want to reuse these sheets or um, um, want to, um, use them just go ahead and put that plastic sleeve over on top so that way they can always have extra practice so those are our materials for our math 
thank you so much for um, watching this video and um, I will keep you posted when and the date as far as when we need to use these materials as we are learning. Thank you.